Hello again, I just thought I'd do a quick demo of uh, using this on a completely new mesh. <coughs> uh, so this is a Dr. Manhattan model I've been working on. So this is just the real-time model with the texture maps baked and a terrifying UV layout. So I'll just drag on the smart material. Uh, so some of this will be off because the UVs are obviously quite different to the last time. So I'll just go in and adjust them. So the tone regions, that's not too bad. Adjust the scale a bit. Oops. Uh, yeah, about there should be okay. So the red, maybe just tighten that a little. Squeeze it a bit. And the yellow. And I'll raise it up slightly. Okay, so the eyelids seem to be quite far off. Yeah, so let's fix that. So we'll work on this one. side Oops. I think this could do with some rotation as well yes yeah, so I'll I'll just leave that like that I'll delete the other one and then just make a copy of it and then change the value. Oops. And then the rotation. Yep, yeah, that'll do. And then uh, bring the whole layer back down again. Oops. Let's do that on the folder. About there. <coughs> so the creases are fine. The rest should be okay. I'll adjust the T zone in the roughness. Oops. So that's not quite how I want it. So let's make that smaller. And reposition a little. That'll do. And yeah, the nose is quite far off. And that'll do. <coughs> so because um, the way the UVs are done, the blue zone is actually affecting the ears, which I don't want. Uh, so I could just manually paint that out in the mask. Uh, but that should more or less be it, really. So I hope this helps. <coughs>